welcome back. Uh, as always, we're going to play some 10 minute games on Shogi Wars. It's always fun. Um, yeah, the, I like the advertising, the new coaching, especially because like you can see, um, I know this is suggesting coaching coaches are waiting and available. Uh, I like that from the perspective of, hey, coaches are offering services. You might as well advertise them. That's very good. But also, you're able to see if coaches are actually playing a game. Uh, we spectated a game before, although I think that was not part of a video. But yeah, it's uh, exciting that this site offers such services. So, um, yeah, I like to see professionals being able to make a good living uh, doing things. Um, oh, oh, I see. Yeah, you're right. The Universe 3 tournament on 81 Dojo. Um, yeah, that's like non-Japanese player. Okay, so it starts, or the join period ends the 15th. That's good to know. Good luck. Uh, yeah, let's play Central File Rook. Why not? Alright. Oh, it continues. Alright, so presently it's beginning of June. Um... So it's good to know that um, yeah, it's possible to join this tournament. Okay, what? Oh, I see. Um, hmm. Wait, I should be aiming for this pawn, maybe? I don't know, but yeah, it's good to know that this uh, universe tournament is accepting applications for next week or so. Um, so if anyone has aspirations to play in it, uh, go for it. Uh, it sounds like fun, even though it's primarily non-Japanese players. So um, I guess the hours you'd be playing it at would be not like 6 a.m. It'd probably be whatever hours are most convenient for American, North American, South American, and other like Europe, Asia, etc. Alright, I'm debating if I chase this pawn, but then my bishop's head is, like, super weak. I don't know. Oh, they're gonna push this freaking pawn again. This gets me every time. Um... Wait. Okay, wait, I confused myself. I am very <laughs> badly confused. Um, hmm. All right, I'm going to do something aggressive because I'm curious. Okay, it's so mostly Europe and Brazil players in this universe tournament. Well, that's exciting. Uh, wow. Um. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna borrow this move, which I think we saw Shogi Harbor play the other day. In, um, yeah, one of the Shogi Sunday games. I could be making that up. I could be confusing that with another recent game, but... Um, yeah, this idea of pressuring the king and the bishop with this silver really early on... I think it's okay. Um, I think this knight jump might be inaccurate, because I'm struggling to find a continuation. Um... Right, so they built this castle. Uh, so I have to make sure not to lose the game now. Um, hmm. 
Oh, wait, and then, like, during the game, uh, she'd mentioned this plan of bringing the Rook up and over. Yeah, this was a Shogi Harbor game. Uh, Free Pawn? Hmm. Maybe my memory's not so bad after all. None uh, of them. Well, no. We're not giving up the Vanguard pawn so quickly here. Right, so my bishop is attacked. Oh, I guess this lets their bishop into the center of the board. Uh, I don't care about this pawn. I do care about uh, breaking their castle. I hope I've not missed something critically important here. Take one of those. So yeah, this hits their rook and the silver, which is undefended. Uh, oh, that's not a free rook. Ha ha ha. Clever. Uh, my bishop needs to be activated, so this is one way to activate it. Um, oh my god, I could have, I should protect my bishop or something. I could block with the bishop. I missed that. Um... Wow. Okay. I was so excited about this attack. I'm still taking the silver and sacrificing the bishop because my position is just that dangerous right now. I was so fixated on taking this point that I forgot bishops could move backwards. Um, but maybe that's for the best. Like, it's a dangerous position anyway. Alright. Um, well, they're no longer threatening to take my bishop. Go home. A knight could be useful, so I could drop a knight here and take this silver. Um, plus, that knight was quite menacing, so let's remove it. 
All right. Um... Let's start getting some more pieces active somehow. My king is so exposed, but I think it's okay. Okay, that surprises me. Um, like, why would you do that? What's the plan? I guess the plan might be to drop a gold or something right here, but I just take it and then I go back. Maybe they intended to drop a gold king takes and then fork my king and bishop or something. Um, okay. My opponent has an interesting awareness of danger. Um, let's put this on a good square. If my opponent... Like, they're forced to think about my move at this point because I'm threatening mate. Um, which... Okay. Uh, I was pretty sure I have mate here. Um, no, definitely I've mate. This this has to mate. We've got a bishop, a knight, a rook, and a golden hand. So like, this there's no way this is not checkmate. Um. Check. Thanks for the game. Well, that was exciting. Wow. All right. Let's play another game. Good luck. That's a nice avatar. Wait, wait, wait. Third foul rook. Oh wow. Uh, central foul rook. Surprise. All right. Um. Hmm. All right. Let's play the same thing we did recently. Uh, bring this silver out. Uh, protect against them opening the file. Um, yeah, let's try the aggressive thing again. It worked the other game. How bad could it be? We're just going to bring the silver up and collect this pawn. No, they'll probably move the pawn. But Oh! Really? That's... That can't be right. This knight blocks the silver. Um, something's up here. I'm nervous now. <laughs> like, this slows down their attack, so I should play carefully, so... Oh, yeah, let's get my king to safety. Oh, welcome. Uh, yeah, let's make sure we have somewhere to run to at the very end of their attack. We have to keep this pawn away from our castle. Um, I don't think I want to move my king once more. Okay. Uh, they pushed the edge. Well, yeah, they had to push the edge pawn. Okay, wow. That's aggressive. The reason this bishop advance is aggressive is because the head of the bishop is not defended. 
Um, I don't think that makes their king any safer. Um, okay. Wow. This is quite aggressive. Um, I have no idea what they're doing. Okay, let's get my king to safety. At least one of our kings will be safe. Yeah, what's this knight doing? It looks cool. I've done this knight move quite a few times myself, but... Aside from looking cool, I'm not sure what it achieves. So, show me where the knight's going. Okay... Um... Sure, let's do it. That seems fun. I'll take one of those while we're at it. Pawn or silver six five to pawn five four. Nana fun. Wait, uh hang on. Hang on, I need some time to figure this out. Okay, we're going to protect my king and just ignore this attack for a second. Um, We've got a pawn in hand. That means soon it's going to be our turn to start an attack somewhere. Um, yeah, this is complicated. I'm going to run away. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I should be doing. It's kind of the story of all my games. Uh, well, I don't know. Like, they didn't bother to build a castle, but I don't really have an attack, so I'm not sure if it matters. 
Also, my home king does have a castle. That's what I'm banking on, but um, <laughs> I'm not actually sure how to exploit this. Uh, this might get easier in a second here. Although, I just did invite them to drop their other rook and sacrifice a rook for two golds. Um, yeah, maybe I should have thought for a couple seconds more before playing that. I mean, yeah, they have a boat castle, but they kind of like forgot to build uh, this side of the boat. Well, no, that's where the bishop would go. This is a boat castle. You're right. Um... Um. All right, I'm actually going to take this lance because I might need it. I'm playing quickly because I'm in time pressure already. But yeah, I'm going to probably Lance drop here, and then Lance takes pawn. I think that's the idea. I could consider a central foul Lance drop, but... Well, yeah, they can't actually drop a pawn against a Lance on the center foul. That could be interesting. Um, I don't like that. All right, you're in check. You've tested my patience here. Show me how you defend this. Check again. Oh, okay, yeah, that is an interesting attempt. Um, I have to admit, I didn't look closely at it. Um, Usually, players don't defend their king by bringing it into the center of the board. Um, but it does take guts to do that. Hmm... Okay, <laughs> this is awkward. Um, thanks for the game? Maybe? I don't know. Like, how far are you going to really advance this king? Are you going to now king takes pawn? Is that the next move? It is. Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, okay. So my bishop's hanging. Um, I'll take this lance. Use this to defend my king.
So I'm attacking your dragon. I'm also trying to checkmate your king. I don't see a checkmate, but, I mean, it's got to be there, right? Yeah, my opponent wants to move into my glorious castle. I admit, like, I've not seen this before. This is, uh, this is like the sort of thing I would try. Just to see if it works. I'm very curious. But also, like, I'm threatening promoted bishop here check. Uh, followed by knight there mate. So... I think they might have to sacrifice... Well, I'm not sure how they defend this. Um, but they'll come up with something. They've been quite resourceful so far. Um, yeah, opponent wants to move in. I can't blame them. It's a nice castle. It definitely is nice. But yeah, I'm hitting their dragon. So it'll cost you one dragon to move in. All right, thanks for the game. Like this check, right? And then king here, and then knight there is. That's mate. I hope it's mate. Yes! All right, sorry I got excited. Thanks for the game. Very exciting game. Oh my goodness, wow. Let's do one more. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it definitely takes some practice to get the hang of this. Good luck. Yeah, sorry, I have dinner planned soon. Uh, here we go. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> um. Oh. Hang on. <laughs> I frequently forget that I sometimes have this move. Um. Yeah, this is actually like now they have to block that with their knight, um, which is a bit awkward. It's playable, but, uh, well, maybe it's playable. Maybe. Um. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing, but it looks fun. For now. <laughs> okay. Um. All right, maybe I should build a castle before I attack. Maybe. Um, maybe it's too late. Yeah, that's definitely too late, but I've messed up. Well, let's pretend that I knew what I was doing. Yeah, I got too excited. Alright, I'll build that out. Push over here. Continue pushing. Um, bring our knight out, question mark. This feels... I don't know if this is good or bad, but 
Um. Oh. Uh oh. All right. Well, here goes nothing. Um, we are gonna get a wild attack slash defense going on in just a second here. Um, yeah, my king is in a universe of danger, and there's nothing I can do about it. Oops. I'm surprised they initiated the knight exchange so quickly. There is no hurry to do that. I might have startled them. Uh, but yeah, I might do a knight drop here, try to take one of these pawns, try to take one of those pieces. I don't know. Oh! Uh, okay. What does that have to do with the price of tea in China? Um, your turn. That's a metaphor, by the way, for like, what? Or Nani? Yeah. <laughs> um... <laughs> uh, interesting username. Welcome, Team Flute. Yep. I have a feeling that I've perhaps not played this game correctly. Um, replace, perhaps, with, like... Well, okay, well, I'm ranked 1Q, so I can't feel too bad about it. But, uh, okay... You can't see it, but I'm visually very startled by this Rook Advance. Like, um... It's a defensive move, but we're playing double swinging Rook, where you don't play defensive moves, you just attack. So I'm going to attack. Uh, but also, like... <laughs> I'm missing something here. Um... This is so startling. Okay, you can have my bishop. Um, yeah, I, I don't understand what just happened this game. I think we both got very excited. Uh, very, 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 very excited. And a lot of things happened which normally would not happen. Um, I think that's my only explanation for how this game is what it is. Um, so there's the opponent's king. Uh, here's me having my opponent's rook. Well, it's now my rook. Uh, they don't have any pawns to defend with. If they want to block my rook, they have to, like, put the knight in the way or something. Um, more likely they do bishop takes silver, and now I've got a bishop. But, um, also I'm threatening, like, taking this silver, and then dropping the silver, dropping the rook, you know. Uh, this doesn't look easy to defend. So this pawn drop might not be the best move in this position. Okay, what? I was just explaining how I might have checkmate here. Um, my opponent is not paying attention. Alright, check. Check from the knight and from the rook. Um, check. Thanks for the game. Instead of dropping the knight one move behind, couldn't I have forked the rook in gold? Oh! Oh! You're probably right. Okay, now that makes sense. Sorry I missed that. Um, yeah, we had several exciting games today. Uh, 
three wins in one day. Oh my goodness. So overall, on Shogi Wars, we have 57 wins, 49 losses. That's not bad. We are very, very, very slowly making our way up the ranks. Uh, yeah, wow. Uh, I'll have to analyze some of these games at a future time. I hope you'll all enjoy this.